my friends had a bachelorette party for me. I wasn't going to do a bachelorette party because we had done an engagement party and we had done a reception dinner kind of thing thing like with everyone who came into town i didn't want to do like a million parties we did a bridal shower you know Mm -hmm. but my immediate friends insisted on a bachelorette party with just the with just like our immediate crew because the bridal shower was a lot of people my mother's friends were there and cousins and you know there's probably about 50 people there It was like a mini wedding for just women and gay men and you get you get presents there you get presents there, exactly. A bachelorette party, you don't. Mm-hmm. So I didn't want to do a million parties. I didn't want to be the annoying bride, but my friends insisted on it because, I don't know, they just, it's fun. So we just did like maybe about 10 of us, like an immediate, you know, whatever. And everything was penis themed. <laughs> Literally everything. <laughs> Suckers like they, and, Exactly. You know, they had straws. straws and the top of the straw was a penis. And then they made me wear a penis hat. And then mm-hmm. we played games where like you bob for penises. So you end up like coming up out of the water with a penis in your mouth. And ha, ha, it's all very funny, you know. And, um, you know, that's like a thing. And, and I thought that was pretty, that was kind of edgy. You know, lots of penises. And we were just a bunch of women <laughs> sitting around putting Is this at a restaurant or is this at somebody's house? <laughs> we ended up doing it at somebody's house. We were going to okay, do it at good. a restaurant. But you know what? We couldn't find a restaurant that we could. It, it was too expensive. My friends all cook. I had a friend who worked in a restaurant. And um, she was a chef, so she made a bunch of stuff. So we actually had a really nice time at my girlfriend's house. I'm pretty sure Chili's would let you bob for penises. (laughs) (laughs) If it's during a half, that would really be a happy hour. (laughs) (laughs) But not Chuck E. Cheese, and that's where I would have wanted to go. Applebee's, Chili's, I think you're pretty safe with the the penis theme. Well, there is a new product that is specifically for, they call them hen parties in the UK because this is a British product. It hasn't come here yet. Oh, come is a pun intended, by the way. Yeah. Um, you can order it. It's not cheap because you got to pay for shipping, but it's called the, how do I say this nicely? Um, I'm just going to say you're going to have to bleep me, okay? <laughs> just go for it. It's called the face game. Okay, and, what is that? All right. So it's this purple thing. It's a it's like a purple device and it has two pink penises, one on each side, okay? Mm-hmm. And you compete with your friend. It's a dual action pump. You compete with your friend to see who can get the penis to get the most excited, if you know what I mean. And the person that loses is the person, I guess you fill it with champagne, you fill it with mm. water, or you fill it with, if you're really risky, you could fill it with something that is white, perhaps. White Russians. White Russian, that kind of thing. And you pump <laughs> each side, and whoever wins... Gets the surprise. Gets it's it's the like surprise. real life. It's... <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. But it's taking the internet by storm. Like I saw it all over Instagram and there's a video out of two women competing and it's funny because um, they have different techniques and everybody on the Instagram post is commenting on their techniques. One woman is just using her thumb and forefinger. Another woman's using her whole hand and men are commenting on which one's better and why. (laughs) It's just become like this viral thing. And I was like, this is hilarious. Like this is bachelorette party to a whole other level and i'm thinking the whole time you could just save money and just hire a guy or maybe even a guy (laughs) will pay you (laughs) so you get two guys and you do it for real well you would have to do two guys because that's the idea you're competing with your friend right you just bring two two friends two guys but you need more than two because it's a so it's like the it's like a, a you know best of a best of Okay, so let's say there's eight women. (laughs) Right. I compete against, I'm the bride. I compete against one of the bridesmaids. So then if I win, then I compete against the winner of the next two. Okay, I got the perfect idea for this. Okay. (laughs) Merge the bachelorette and the bachelor party (laughs) together. And have have that have those in separate rooms, <laughs> okay? So like room one A is the bachelors, and room one B is the bachelorettes, and uh-huh. and guys and girls can come in and out of the rooms and play games all night long. You combine them, you save money. There you go. Bring in bring in the groom to be and his best man, and be like, okay, you two are up. 
And then <laughs> right. you, you do it all together at the same night, same hotel room. You, you could even get those rooms that, that have the door between them. You just saved somebody $52 plus shipping. <laughs> <laughs> and it's more fun and more accurate <laughs> to see who's better. Right. <laughs> <laughs> because the, 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 the fake thing doesn't really know really good technique. That's it just true. It doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> Problem solved. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I'm glad I ran this by you. Because guys will even pay you. I mean, you don't. You'd save the fifty. You could pay the fifty-two dollars and get the shipping, or the guy will pay you fifty-two dollars to, to get that done. You know that's good. Oh, and if there's not enough people in the bachelor, and the, the sorry, and there's not enough people on the bachelor party and the bachelorette party, very simple. Put an ad on Craigslist, or people can go again. <laughs> Then it's the it's the stakes are higher the second time around. <laughs> <laughs> so if it takes longer, it's going to take longer that's the second time. But if you can do it, then you're really good. Then you're the grand prize winner, and you deserve the prize. <laughs> Whatever it is, you know, get get a new car and just play for for prizes. <laughs> no, my friends like what they did for prizes is they got they went to Mac makeup and they just got a bunch of like, you know, lipstick and nail polishes. So <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's all you're getting, but you know, you you've you've earned it. <laughs> if you win, you get mascara. Go. <laughs>